We'll use multiple types of aggregates and sands. They'll be dumped below ground and fed into the silos with what's called a bucket conveyor. The bucket conveyor is feeding the aggregate up to our silos. We don't want to change the sieve analysis of the aggregates that we're using. So by using a bucket conveyor, we can maintain that quality. You'll notice that we're using silos, not bins for our aggregate. Once again, good consistent feed, good consistent gradation of aggregates and sands gives us the highest quality product. We're standing by our pigment dispensing system. We're using granufin, a granular iron oxide based pigment. It's all air blown into the mixers overhead. We can control the dispensing of that pigment within a 30 second of an ounce, maintaining consistent quality and color. Let's take a look at those mixers overhead. Overhead, you see the silos feeding cement into our planetary mixers. We're air blowing granufin iron oxide pigment in here as well. Our sand, our aggregate, all mixed together before water's even added. Once that's done, I can feed into one of three hoppers a specific color to whatever blend I'm making, feed it below into three separate conveyors, which will eventually feed the machine that's gonna make the block that we're famous for. Let's take a look.